Hello and welcome everyone. Dude Man 2003 here, slash Nick's Harbinger. And welcome back to Earthbound. We're not gonna continue where I left off. Alright, so last time in Earthbound, uh, I got here into the uh, underworld. Now, um, I did do an attempt recording um, last time, but it didn't really go so well because the game was lagging really, really badly. So I'm gonna see if I can actually talk with this uh, guy again, hopefully. Yes, I can, okay. You finally came, Ness. Finally you talked to me. Listen, Ness, I'm going to tell you something very important. You may want to take notes. Okay, I got my pencil and paper ready. Ready? Yup. You're the chosen one. Okay, Buzz Buzz told me that. Your destiny is not only yours, it's the destiny of the whole universe. There will be a time in which all of you in the universe will overlap each other. It's not necessary to understand now. Do you remember Giant Step and Own It? Yeah, where I had to deal with the Titanic Ant. That is one of your sanctuary. It is a spot which gives you power and allows you to realize all your skills. There was a monster that protected it, and we killed him. The monster was influenced by the power of the place. You must have beaten those monsters. You must reach all the eight power spots in the world. When the soundstone records the melodies of all eight power spots, you can finally see your world. That must be the upgraded version of your sanctuary. I'll tell you all the power spots. Okay, really? Why would you need to take notes on this? Because we've already been through seven of them, except for one more. Giant Step and Own It, the Leap Up Steps in Peaceful Rest Valley near Tucson. Milky Well in Grapefruit Falls in Saturn Valley. Rainy Circle found by Jeff in Winters. Magnet Hill at the edge of the city of Forside. Pink Cloud, which Pooh knows in Dalam. And the Lumine Hole, where the Shining Leechin lives in the cave. A new place is now going to be opened up to you. Fire Spring, located southwest of here. Listen to the melodies of all eight power spots. If you do not fail, you may upset Gigas's plans. Understand this? The time will come. The time when the destiny of you and the whole universe will overlap. It is fast approaching. Alright, so... After talking with him, you can just head out here. If you actually... They actually called this place, like, uh, this place isn't the cage to keep them in, it's the cage to keep the dinosaurs out. Or, in their perspective, keep the dinosaurs in. <laughs> Strangely enough. Even though I listened to the talkative Mr. Rock's story, I don't understand what he's talking about. I do. In fact, because we've been dealing with this all day. I don't see the talkative Mr. Rock. That rock really jabbers away. Okay. Um, whenever you see those earthquakes, that means that geyser open up. Geysers in the underworld are healing spots. Other than, uh, this, uh, Tenga, Tenda actually heals you up. Now, um, in the failed recording session, I accidentally went right instead of left, because he said southwest, and I don't know how I got southeast and southwest mixed up. And also I found an item, it's called the Star Pendant, which is located... Um, about right of where that was, so I don't need to go there again, so I'm just gonna head west. Go through that hole, and all you will find is just a dead end. You're supposed to go south, west, not just west. And time to deal with a dinosaur. Now the thing about the dinosaurs here is this place is a good place to uh, grind, because these guys give you like 11,000 uh, uh, EXP each time you kill them. Well, this one, I think, gives you about 9,000. It's only the purple dinosaurs, which, uh, uh, just something to be worried about. And yes, I did say purple. There's, there's friggin' Barney in this place. That was weird. Okay, so that... Okay, so, probably that didn't do anything wrong. Hey, what's wrong with this thing? Okay, killed the dinosaur. I guess when those 
For some reason, whenever I fight those dinosaurs, they don't attack me. Or at least I get lucky, so lucky that I don't even take a hit from them. It's funny how that happens. Alright, I'm gonna go uh, to the inn over there because there is an inn-like place. Oh, crap! <sighs> okay, let's deal with a purple dinosaur. These ones are stronger. Yeah, Barney is strong. How about that? And Barney's gonna try and kill you. Now, uh, I don't want to deal with you guys, so I'm just gonna fire a multi-bottle rocket on you. If I had one. What? Okay, well, I guess uh, I'm not going to be firing a rocket now. I'm just going to shoot these guys. Oh yeah, and something about the Chompasaur, or yeah, let's just call it who they really are, Barney. They... they can shoot... they can uh, repel attacks. Just regular attacks, not uh, magic. So be careful when you actually fight them head on. They'll deal like half the damage you dealt to them back at you. See? Okay, PSI- oh my! Okay, ooh! Oh crap, this is bad. Really bad. Okay, hurry up and beat this guy up. Aww, they died. Oh shoot! Well, someone's dead. Okay. Well, Paula's dead twice. Alright, so after you deal a couple of damages, then uh, his shield disappears. It works the same way as PSI. Wow, 22,000. I didn't expect he would give that much. It looks funny seeing these people from, like, pixelated top view, because it looks like, uh, Ness looks like he's from, uh, Mario Brothers. The original Mario Brothers. Alright, if you talk to him, you can, uh, we charge you two hundred dollars per hum per person that's alive to be revived or revitalized. Sorry, but still these guys are dead. So okay, good thing I have PSI healing. Or let's uh, let Jeff do that. Not Jeff. Poo. All right, revive Paula and finally revive. Uh, Revive Jeff. It sucks that Pooh is the only one who knows these things besides Ness, but has the least amount of psychic points. Alright, let me talk to you again so I can actually... I probably should have just used regular healing so I could do that. Alright, let's do this. And there's a giant orb. <laughs> Yeah, there are three types of enemies here. Dinosaurs and the moon. This is freaking Majora's Mask now. Not only is this Jurassic Park. But yeah, I apologize in the fact that I had to skip a few things, which I haven't done yet. But as long as I pointed it out, it should be fine. And I still forgot to give Pooh that... Not Pooh, Jeff, that rocket that Pooh has. This is terrible. Um, let's use the heavy bazooka on him. And in the Pooh knows PSI Thunder. But PSI Thunder isn't that very good. I don't even think there's anybody who's weak to PSI Thunder. Alright, and deflex the attack. Ooh! Oh, I missed! Oh, crap! Okay, don't die on me, Jeff. Don't die on me, Jeff! At least it doesn't get faster. That's, that would be terrible. Okay, and... Crap! Quit missing! Quit missing! Jeff's gonna die! I don't know what's with Ness, but he always misses with his baseball bat. Even though he has such a big target right in front of him. Whatever. Let's just keep going. We need to find the... Uh, the... The fire spring. Okay, this is as southwest as I can go. Nope, there's more. Never mind. Let's just keep going down. I don't care. The best way to avoid dinosaurs is just by hanging on to the left side. Hanging near the trees, because the dinosaurs can't go past the trees. And there's a save point over there. I better use that. And there's another dinosaur over there. And, like you said, this place is a save point. 
here the dinosaurs don't come attack me so I can relax. Except now I can't get out. What do you mean you can't get out? It's, there's a hole over there. Alright, let's call my dad so I can just... So I can save right here. This place should be safe enough to save. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep working because uh, it's only been like 10 minutes since I started this recording. Barney! Barney is strong. It's surprising. And there's the cave. I wish there was like some sort of faster run button. That would be nice. Alright, who's healing on Jeff? Jeff will certainly need that. Okay. Aha, Barney, you can't catch up to me, ha! Huh? Woo! I made it without getting hit by that dinosaur. Alright, now welcome to Fire Spring. Now, this is the part of the recording that I didn't make it to. Thank goodness, huh? So, back to blind run commentary. So, psychic. Major Psychic Psycho. A little redundant, are we? Alright, uh. Oops. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, use PSI Freeze on one of them. You shoot one of them, and. Uh, you freeze the Psychic Psycho. So there's Major Psychic Psycho and there's Regular Psychic Psycho. Just froze one of them. Yes, I fire! What? Well, I am immune to um, getting hit and hurt by fire because of my talisman. Also, I got a Star Pendant, so... I mentioned that I actually got an item called the Star Pendant earlier. Yeah, it can actually... Um, well, it doesn't nullify. It, uh... Um, lessens the damage of uh, PSI moves, all of them. So that's a real item to, a nice item to get. Okay, 17,000. Paula leveled up, but only got HP up by one. Awesome, I guess. Okay, heal up Paula. Have to make sure I keep Pooh's HP up. Arps. Uh, not. God dang, I keep messing up all this. Okay, give that to, uh, me. Why not? Hopefully speed also means accuracy, because Ness's accuracy sucks. Hard. Okay, uh, what can I give him? Um, C pendant, I'll need that. Is there anything useless? I give this to, uh, Pooh. Why not? Here, have a baseball bat, even though Pooh will never use such a thing. And, uh, give... Yeah, this is it, the C pendant. Yeah, it's one of those items that can be equipped, so why do you take me off the screen there instead of taking me to the equip menu? Game. Okay, I'll equip that. Uh, not give. Uh... Okay, now, Jeff... You need a multi-bottle rocket. Because that is one of the best items I've ever gotten. And someone eat that plain roll because I'm sure that no one is really going to use that. 77. Nice. All that for a plain roll. You know, give me that pendant. It does increase my defense and it immunes uh, all PSI attacks. Who to deal with? Evil Elemental. They they look like apostrophes or smoke. Okay, I'll spy on one of them. We'll use PSI Star Storm because that'd be useless. Okay, so that doesn't really work. What about the PSI Fire? Okay, so it's the one that I avoided. Wow. I thought it's because that this is a an elemental dungeon that, or a fire dungeon that, so uh, fire wouldn't work on any of these guys. Oh well, I guess I was wrong. But being wrong is just part of life, you know. Okay, better conserve who's uh psychic points or else uh, he can't do PSI Star Storm. And this time I hope PSI Star Storm would work instead of retaliating, retaliating against Pooh and killing him. Mess leveled up to level 69, Pooh leveled up too. 
Okay, no one's learning anything new. That's dumb. Okay, it looks... I guess I can't walk through that thing, or else I'm probably gonna take damage from that. Oh no, someone vouched for me on that. Discouraging fame and the uh, cohort. Okay, just use PSI games. You use PSI fire. Um, awesome on them. You shoot the soul consuming flame because that sounds really, really bad. And maybe he recovers from fire. Or just take less damage from fire. That works too. Yeah, using science to kill him. Ow. That really hurts. Alright, let's just bash the evil elemental. Alright, he's dead. 18,000, no one leveled up yet. Whatever, let's just keep going. Fire. <laughs> he finished that, Jeff leveled up. Yeah, nothing new came out of him. Well, nothing new comes in Jeff, except for him making inventions and all that. Alright, bottle of DX water, I think this re um, replenishes psychic points. Almost the same as the water you drink in town, it recovers. Yeah, I knew it. Charm coin, uh, can we get that to Jeff? Well, Jeff can't hold it, so what's the whole freaking point? And now you have a PSI caramel anyways. Okay, do I have a healing item? Hmm. No, I guess not. I don't have anything that heals. Alright, then. Ness is the only one with good PSI. So. Alright, just gonna heal up everyone. Okay, let's just keep going. Fire. And a present. I'll take the present, if you please. Okay, so I probably would have just killed him just by using regular... Just by using regular attacks, so I don't get why it doesn't do the flashing thing. Bag of Dragonite. What does that do, anyways? I forgot. Yeah, I forgot. I always forget these things. You sprinkle the powder on your friends, the friends turns to- Oh yeah! That's certainly useful. Okay, uh... Okay, it looks like I can't go through... Go to anything here. Oh uh, yeah, I guess not. You don't actually get hurt from walking on fire. What the heck?! Okay, 19,000, that's good. Where else is there to go? I see... God dang it! Oh, wait. Wait, I thought I could just kill this guy in one hit. Well, not one hit, just... Well, just by regular... What? Everyone missed? Okay, Jeff, you're the trooper. And who leveled up to? Okay. Looks like I sh what? Oh, okay. Good. I won. Alright, did anyone level up? No, nope. I'm just gonna leave then. We go to the right this time, and there is a cave down here. You know what? Screw off! Screw off, you! Just overkill. Oh well, as long as I keep Jeff's uh, friggin' rocket, then I should be fine. Okay, moving up to the side. What? No, oh, and let Ness level up to 70. You learn something new finally. Yes, you do. Life up, um, awesome, uh, not awesome, Omega. Hey, what's this? Oops. 
present, there's a cherub's pad. And I'm under attack anyways. Okay. Paula died. What else is new? Okay, let's get that uh, horn of life in there. Okay, hey, yo, Paula. Okay, thank you. Awesome. Let's clear out this room. And Jeff leveled up. Oh, baby! Offense by three. Vitality, IQ by three. Nice. And that's it. What do you mean that didn't count? Okay, moving on. Uh, do I have any more uh, rockets? Okay, I better use this bottle of DX water on Pooh. Yay! Ooh, 42. Nice. Oh, what's in here? More fire. Is there any any other enemies? Oh crap. And Pooh leveled up too. Okay, what do you win? Uh, do you win anything? Nope. Fine. Yes, I'm leaving then. Jeff's uh, dead again. Mm, secret herb. All right, Jeff's arrived. Looks like on camera I get lucky with that because it has only a chance of reviving people, not guaranteed. Okay, give me that caramel. Okay, I don't get why they had to climb down that ladder. Um, all right, eighteen thousand, good for me. Whoa, look at all that fire. <laughs> okay, I have to deal with all that so I can actually move on. Do I have anything that I can use? What does the rabbit's foot do? Foot must be equipped. It protects you from paralysis. Increases speed. Okay, so it doesn't increase luck. Groove band must be equipped on your arm. Increases defense. Helps you keep from hypnotized. Okay, who has the lowest defense besides Pooh? 186, 176. Okay, Jeff needs it. I don't know if Pooh can equip it. Nope, Pooh can't. PSI, give me life up. Jeff. Also, life up, uh, Paula. What? Two of them? Fucking two? Okay, gonna go gun for it. Gun for it. Yeah, I made it. Alright, am I gonna fight the Year Sanctuary boss yet? Or do I have to deal with two doors? Okay, what's for the store? Or really cave? Uh Okay, really nothing. Oh, it leads to an item. Okay, I guess I'll take that item. Alright, what is it? It's present there's a moonbeam gun. That's for Jeff. There's a lot of things for Jeff. Uh let's see, shield killer. Rusher. I can give that to someone who doesn't care. Okay, and let's get the let's get the Cheru's band on you. Okay, Jeff. And also give here's the uh, crusher beam. Or moon beam gun, sorry. Seems like I'm gonna give him back the item that he gave Paul that he gave Paula. Hey, and wow, increase good. Arms, Kiru band, increases it by 10. Every bit helps. That's the end of this place. Okay, so where is that your sanctuary boss anyways? Right there, I see him. Okay, I already hit 45 minutes in the recording, but by the end- WHAT?! Alright, Bag of Dragonite? Yox! Or Yoinks! He- WHAT?! 43?! This item isn't that good! And Pooh died! I didn't want another person dying because I don't think I have any more uh, healing items. Alright, Ness leveled up. And Paul leveled up too. Did she win anything? 
No. Okay then. Okay, Boo died, so I better uh, get one of them items for him. Do I have anything? Uh, everyone seems to be full except Paula. Okay, you have a secret herb on you. You better give that to Paula. Alright, use the secret herb. Alright, who's alive? Where's the back? What? You're gonna sneak up on us? What does this do, anyways? He killed the soul's consuming flame. A monkey and pin the enemy down. Oh, that's how you do it. It solidifies the enemy. Okay. Alright. Let's keep moving. And Jeff leveled up, too. Alright. Alright, time to keep moving. There's this your sanctuary boss. Alright, so I'm gonna end the recording right here, and the next part we're gonna take on the your sanctuary boss. See you, everyone!